Are you a simple taxpayer from Brazil? Then here is a solution to calculate your ICMS substitution tax value. For the purpose of this video, let us take a supplier from Sao Paulo. And we define the category code as triple one. Next, we review the fields in the fiscal information tab. The taxpayer field is populated as one, ICMS substitution as Z, and ICMS code as two. Now, as our supplier is from Sao Paulo, we take the destination branch also as Sao Paulo. Next, we review whether the ICMS substitution is Z in the fiscal information tab. We set the transaction nature and suffix as triple one and double zero respectively. Here we also set the ICMS code as two and ICM substitution as Z. Next, we set up from state and to state as SP to SP to retrieve the ICMS tax and ICMS substitution markup tax rate for the state. Here we set the ICMS code as two again. After that, we move on to adding the purchase order and the purchase order is created. Here we receive the created purchase order. Then we enter the NOTA fiscal number, which is used to find the ICMS substitution and ICMS substitute values. The calculation takes into account factors such as substitute base amount, ICMS substitution markup rate, ICMS interest rate tax rate, or ICMS state tax. The legislative change from the existing process is that now the ICMS tax rate is negated from the ICM substitution value to get the ICM substitute tax. To learn more, visit us online at learnjte.com. Thanks for watching.